Greetings, friends. And welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. Yeah, Ursaluna's doing this. Yeah, he's doing his little bleeping. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like arrhythmic, too. It's like yeah. blah, 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 Wait, was she behind? There was something on the ground. Is this Ooh. her? Yes. Is it you? Well, that was easy. <laughs> Oh, Tom, how did it all go with Ursaluna? I helped him. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a bunch, fella, but how'd you find me all the way out here? Uh, from the potato mochi. You follow the scent of the potato mochi I bought at the Wallflower? Yeah. Man, I wish I could eat some more of those right now. Jubilee Village sure was a lot of fun. You people are all addicted to potato mochi. Right. Eat something different. My <laughs> luck's run out, though, as you can most likely tell. I got chased by a Pokemon and sprained my ankle pretty bad as I was running away. It's almost like the world wants to punish me. <laughs> ah, there you are, Rizu, right? Eek! No. My mistress, Kalaba, uh, I, 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 I didn't... <laughs> I owe you an apology. <laughs> I treated you with disrespect, thinking you were just some whelp from the Diamond Clan. I'm sorry for that. I should have treated you better. Huh? Wait, but... It's not your fault that Lilligan became frenzied, nor that my Ursaluna was so enraged. You were trying to help them both, weren't you? I didn't even have the courtesy to listen to you. Th you'd think someone who's lived as long as I have would be more patient. It's okay, I didn't do a good job explaining myself either. Ursaluna only started acting weird after he got too close to Lilligan and smelled her perfume. She was already frenzied by that point, so I'm sure that's what caused it. Ah, uh, that explains the strange powder I found on Ursaluna. It must have been powder from Lilligan. But what happened to your leg, dear? I was gathering ingredients to make bombs, but I, I fell and sprained my ankle. <laughs> the world wants to punish me. <laughs> <laughs> See, the reason I went to Chubalife was to get help for Ursaluna and also learn about crafting. But while I was there, I bumped into Professor Leventon and he told me about the bombs you used to, you used to quell Cleaver. So I thought I'd make some for Lilligant using her favorite foods. You galaxy people know all sorts of things, like how to ball food up and <laughs> right. throw it at angry Pokemon. <laughs> I'd like to learn even more from you, really. Where did you come right. from? <laughs> well, then we better take care of our lady and get all this mess resolved first. Adamant! <laughs> what were you thinking doing all this yourself? Did you think I couldn't help you with my flailing arms? Oh, yeah, no yeah. one <laughs> would blame you for thinking so. Not much of a leader, am I? I've never even seen the almighty Sinnoh with my own eyes. And I failed to imagine that Lilligan might have become frenzied too. Listen up, Tom. I'll take the bombs that Arizu made and meet you at Brava Arena. Don't you worry, Arizu. Tom will call Lilligan and that will be that. Things should settle down. Head to Brava Arena, Tom. That's where Lilligan's seat lies. Arizu will be taken care of, my dear Biberal, and I will make sure she reaches her lady. Cool. Thanks for volunteering me to do this. <laughs> right. Oh, are they just gonna, like, chill there now? I guess so. Ooh, Onyx. It's over yeah. to the right. And didn't uh, Adam and just, like, steal <laughs> my stuff? Yeah, he's, Onyx like, is... <laughs> freaking out over there. Yeah, he's missing some frames. It looked like he was dancing for a second. He, I think he's, like, moving around, but because he's so far away, his frames are jumping. It's mm -hmm. like, I don't know if you remember, uh, I think it happened in Mario Odyssey and in this game, but, like, if birds are too far away, you just see, like, the wings up and then wings down. You don't see, like, the actual flapping. Mm-hmm. Also, they're talking about Lilligan. I didn't even think Lilligan was going to be in this one. He's a yeah. black and white Pokemon. And they... Oh. oh <laughs> and they said something about Lilligan only being female, and I'm like, I don't know if that's accurate. Well, at least in black and white, I don't know if it is. Mm -hmm. It kind of makes sense, because it's supposed to be like a dancing flower lady. I don't know if we ever caught any of those stunky either that were walking around. Yeah. You might be able to stealth catch them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not that one. <laughs>
<laughs> Come on, Stunky. <laughs> Whoa, what did he... <laughs> did he just, weird. like, jump backwards or glitch backwards? Mm -hmm. Ow. Dang it. Oh, you don't see me. <laughs> I don't think Weasel would kill him. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Poison from the sky! The big bombable rock in the way. Mm. I'm gonna see if I can. Nope. It doesn't even walk, say anything. Walk into it. <laughs> I was pressing A. I wanted to see if it would be like, this rock looks breakable. <laughs> Maybe a Pokemon can smash it. No, it can't. <laughs> Round two. Spend this whole episode trying to sneak up on Stunky. Sweet. Yes. Nice. Stunky. Now what? <laughs> <laughs> Let's head for this target and see what that's all about. If I can get around this rock. <laughs> you can do it, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Who needs to break the rocks when you can just do that? <laughs> I didn't think it was actually going to work. Now I just have to climb this mountain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Great. You got it, buddy. You can try jumping, too. Not this time. Make it. <laughs> Come on, Dude. swim, Tom, swim. He's on the edge. <laughs> <laughs> Grabbing the wall. <laughs> oh my god, this game is like fun, but also very jank. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, it looks like I'm not, okay. The border was like all dark. I was like, oh, am I about to die or something? I think Zubat's about to level up mm -hmm. and evolve. Ooh, we should just take out that Parasect real quick. Yeah. You think Zubat can handle him? No, but I think <laughs> that, um... Koala. Yeah, we'll one-shot him. Uh, and then we're probably gonna have to fight the Paris right after, but that'll be fine. Yeah, we're at the same time. He got a health bar. Mm. I think we're close to the camp, though. Mm-hmm. Zubat can evolve. Nice. I think it's up on the D pad. And then you press ZL. There you go. Yeah, this menu's a bit confusing. Mm -hmm. What? Zubat's evolving? What? <laughs> There's another piece of the thingy. Oh. Is it purple thingy? <laughs> it's not worth it. <laughs> I'm sure eventually we'll get like a swimming Pokemon or something. Mm -hmm. Can we fast travel where he wants us to go? That's a Reese's predicament. What's the other one? I guess we can't. And you pressed X. Um, uh, no, I was pressing A. <laughs> that's where Ariz is. Oh, well, that wait, it, that's the Myrland's camp. Huh. 
Yeah, maybe we should go there just to heal, but like I thought we needed to go to the Brava Arena. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> I'm losing my mind! <laughs> What? It says that's the Brava Arena. <laughs> and we can't travel there? When you when you pressed X, it didn't let you, right? It was like, wanna go to the camp? No, we no. don't wanna go to the camp. The Marlands camp. <laughs> no, I don't wanna go to the Marlands. Wait, if, Not the if, Marlands. if you press X on the, the blackish looking ones that won't let you teleport, ah, uh, that's just a freaking request. <laughs> Yeah, so now we're just gonna have to try and go around and mm. get up to the Brava Arena. It looks like it's like up the mountains. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, do I gotta go like all the way down and then back up? I don't think so. There should be like a little bridge to get across the water we've mm -hmm. been using for the past few episodes. It'd be cool if I could zoom in. You can um, open up the map again and then press ZR. ZR, R2, yeah. I don't know where that bridge is. Um, uh, might be this. It thing. might be, yeah. Or, yeah, see, like, right where, like, it's kind of go down a little bit. See how the river's, like, straight right there? And there's, like, it looks like there's a little brown thing right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ghastly gas. Mm. Found it. <laughs> so now we just gotta go all the way up there somehow. Yeah, maybe I gotta get this also, way first. Also, those little white rectangle things look like other camps. Yeah. Is that? I wonder if that's what those are. This one says it's the diamond settlement. It'd be really great if there was like a compass on the screen. Mm -hmm. But no, all they put are their freaking. Okay, you can make it. You're the... <laughs> so janky. Ooh, a lick it's on. Lick it's on. Join us. <laughs> Sweet. I don't know if this is like how you're supposed to be doing this, <laughs> but like we're going up the mountain, so. Yeah. <laughs> Just really jankly. Yeah, like. <laughs> this is so jank! <laughs> 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 that was insane. I don't know if this, <laughs> this is like right or not, but <laughs> you can do it, buddy. You trying to get the blue stone or <laughs> no? I'm just ah. trying to get up that giant hill. <laughs> Combi. Ooh, suit of water. I think we should catch him because we're gonna need to rank up. Yeah. Yeah. Eventually, or they're gonna be like, oh, well, I'd love to give you the next task, but, um, you only rank one. Mm-hmm. Hopefully he's not as bad in this game as he is in the other games. Sudowoodo? Yes. Yeah, in, like, the original Gold and Silver, I remember oh. he was always annoying. He's, oh, to catch. to catch, yeah, him. no, he's, it's because he's, like, an event Pokemon in that game. Yeah. I wonder if either of those are girl combis. Let me see. Oh, 
cool. But I think it's a guy, which means it won't evolve. <gasps> there was another one to your right. It looked like another guy one. Mm. Excuse me. <coughs> what is that behind the tree? It looks like a carnivine. Is he sleeping? I, it looks like he's sleeping. Yeah. You could probably take it out like really easy. Mm hmm. <laughs> Why do you get two turns? <laughs> See ya. <laughs> didn't learn. Why? Wait, now. I guess you have to go to a um, check moves menu. Or change moves. Double hit. <sighs> uh. Ooh. Wait, is he... I guess he's not paralyzed. Oh, ooh, I guess... <laughs> That's weird. Then wear it off after the battle. That's nice. Look at that grass. <laughs> That would suck if grass did that in real life. Yeah, it just starts clipping and... Oh my god. I would stay inside. Oh, now it's fine, because the battle's not happening. Yeah. <laughs> Everything's back to normal. Yep. Everything's just fine and dandy. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> oh my god. This probably like isn't the way they wanted us to do it either. Yeah. You cannot yeah. go any farther. The pinpoint spire <laughs> is beyond the wall. You can do it, buddy. I believe in you. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> gonna go around the long way. Yeah, I think we gotta go like down and around. We're like pointing straight at it. We just gotta, yeah, loop around. <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> that one time he went up like that real steep looking one, I was like, holy crap. I think it's because he got clipped, though, in something like that. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, like a little divot type of thing. <laughs> Bravo, Arena! Here I am. So you've come. I take it that means you're ready. Hmm, hold on a bit. <laughs> there anywhere to heal? Um, no, but we have items and we can craft. Yeah. 
that potion at the top should be enough to heal both Buizel and Quilava. I think it's 60 HP per. Yeah. We're fine, and Lilligan is grass type, so hopefully it won't be crazy. Mm -hmm. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, press B. <laughs> no, hold on a bit. <laughs> Lady Lil against the sight to see, even her frenzy. Behold her and be grateful. Yeah, I'm real grateful. I hope we didn't keep you waiting. All it took was one of my pulses to get a Rizu's leg all patched up. Kalava, ma'am, I'm deeply sorry we've had to lean on your help so much, especially as we're from different clans. Arizu tried to solve this whole situation herself. I dare say she bit off more than she could chew and caused some trouble, but her heart was in the right place. In her chest. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, the Lady of the Ridge Lilligan is like a dancer, always in motion, always darting about. You'll want to watch her real close and learn how to dodge her moves. That's right, if you keep on dodging, she might get tired out and that'll be your opening. That's when you can bring out your own Pokemon and prove your might. Don't let me down. So, just like Cleaver. <laughs> you gonna give us bombs? I think it started with Sun and Moon, where they started doing these, like, oh, look, it's a big Pokemon epic moment things <laughs> all the time. But it's like, if you just gave that to us with, like, the legendaries near the end of the game, we'd be fine. <laughs> like, this doesn't even look like a look <laughs> Lady of the Ridge. It's not a lady. It's a Pokemon! Mm. Oh, and we have bombs to throw. Yeah, like, thanks for this thrilling gameplay, Game Freak. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, if they had just, like, skipped all of this and then just had, like, a really epic battle with, like, Palkia, Dialga, Arceus, all of them near the end, mm -hmm. I feel like... Oh, maybe they will do that still. I don't know. I'm, I haven't played this whole game, so... Lilligan was burned. Nice. Sweet. Nice. It's a lot easier than Cleaver. <laughs> oh, now's your chance. Throw some bombs. Oh, yeah, they do like a lot more now. Oh, I guess we gotta, like, dodge into that one. Yes, we... <laughs> yes, this is Pokemon. <laughs> Not even hitting her with half of these things, but it still works. Mm -hmm. uh, Only battle you again already. Yeah. Sheesh. Only 20 more bombs to go. 
Ooh, Pokemon time. I didn't even hit her with another one. Yeah, that was kind of weird. Is she gonna have full HP again? Yeah, yeah. she is. Awesome. Course. Poison powder. Oh, but you miss because you're an idiot. I just want Kolava to live through this so he can get that EXP. Mm -hmm. And then it's gonna ask you to throw bombs again. Mm -hmm. Ah. Sweet. Oh no! <laughs> I guess we did it. <laughs> that literally looks like a poop bag. <laughs> Today in class, we made little bean bags, and we threw them at Pokemon. <laughs> Nice. Sweet. <gasps> Buizel can evolve, nice. and so can Geodude! And friggin' Kalava finally mastered the flame wheel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> the meadow plate from Lilligant. Nice. Sweet! Hey, thank you. You didn't just save Lilligant, you saved Arizu as well. I appreciate it. First to Saluna, and now Lilligant? You're amazing, you know that? Being all frenzy didn't suit Lilligant one bit. I'm so happy she's back to her great, graceful self. Not grateful self. <laughs> Lil. Arizu, you still owe someone an apology. Huh? Oh, don't worry about it. A young one like her is bound to get caught up in some trouble from time to time. Remember what's written on the Salation ruins. All lives touch others to create something. <laughs> Anew and alive. All <laughs> lives touch other lives to create lives. <laughs> There's what's up in those words. I imagine they're the, the teaching of Almighty Sinnoh itself. Lives, 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 yeah! <laughs> of, of course, I'd completely forgotten about them until a certain somebody helped me remember. We owe you one, ma'am. Don't try to solve something by yourself, Arizu. Let Tom do it all. <laughs> You're a warden of all people. We should know how to stand in solidarity with others. By doing nothing. <laughs> it's our job to stand side by side by with Pokemon. And by that I mean stand aside and let Tom <laughs> do all the work. And hold on to our Pokemon so that they can't help. <laughs> yes, I know. I'm sorry. Well, I can hardly start yelling at you now after Kalawa wrapped all that up so nicely. And dumbly. <laughs> <laughs> Just one more thing, Arizu. I knew you were trying to get... I know you were trying to do what you thought was right, and I approve of that. But from now on, do it without keeping things from me, agreed. Oh my god, too much chatting! <laughs> right. Other than... <laughs> no need to change a thing. Except maybe to put in some training if anything else happens to Lilligan. I need you ready to protect her like the warden you are. I understand. Let's work together from now on to keep the Marlin safe, Arizu. I'll be sure to inform Irida that both the Diamond Clan and the Galaxy team helped save Ursaluna. You did well, Tom. All our different groups finally joined hands to work together today. God, wrap it up already. Also, you guys didn't join hands to do anything. You yeah, literally you stood, stood by and, and, and let me do it yeah. all. Like a bunch of bums. Oh my god, these people. <laughs> they suck. Listen, you know me. I'm Adam, and yes. Yes, we know. and we know. We know the Diamond Clan, and I worship Almighty Sinnoh. Story of my life. Ruler of time. <laughs> Story of my life. <laughs> time was all about change, and we can't live in fear of that. We can only try to help the time we live and change for the better. Oh my god. Something tells me helping you folks out will help me do that. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you for everything, Tom. I think I'll stay and talk to Lil again for a while. <clears throat> what happened, Lil again? How a kind hearted Pokemon like you end up all frenzied, huh? Though it's not like I'm perfect, I hid things, and I lied, and I couldn't keep you safe, and I cheated on my husband, and I stole from the <laughs> store, and I killed a guy. <laughs> I'm really sorry about everything. All the lying and cheating and swindling. Liddy. <laughs> it's Arizu. 
Yeah, <laughs> not Liddy. Do you want to evolve our guys real quick and then yeah. call it quits? Weasel and Geo, dude. I felt like it was 26 for Weasel, but mm -hmm. I wasn't sure. I like never use Weasel. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds interesting. Float Zell. I'm pretty sure every Pokemon we have in our team right now can evolve one more time. <laughs> okay, except for uh, Float Zell. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Durr. <laughs> Graveler. <laughs> Graveller! <laughs> cool. Yeah. You think now's a good time to call it? Yeah. Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for joining us today, and we hope you'll join us next time. Bye-bye. Have a good one.